हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू कंप्लीट एसक्यूएल ट्रेनिंग वीडियो सीरीज इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द स्टोर प्रोसीजर एंड यूजर डिफाइंड फंक्शन दिस इज द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन सो इफ यू गोइंग टू अटेंड द एनी एसक्यूएल इंटरव्यू यू विल गेट द क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द व्हाट इज द मेजर डिफरेंस बिटवीन द स्टोर प्रोसीजर एंड यूजर डिफाइंड फंक्शन i will talk in the detail uh, what is the major difference uh, for if you ha- if you have the experience in the sql uh, what answer you, you need to be tell and if you are the facer uh, what answer you need to be tell to the interviewer so i will talk about in the detail so if you not get a chance please go and uh, watch the all the video which i already uploaded under the pande guru ji youtube channel under the playlist complete sql and database tutorial uh beginner to advance if you want to learn the uh, from the one to one training as well you can visit pandeguruji.graphi.com and uh, uh, you can enroll the course uh, which uh, i would provide the personally one to one training if you want to the complete sql uh, uh, interview question and the all the training material like the notes which uh, uh, i prepare in the detail detail explanation i have the detail explanation of the each and every question i have uh, more than 300 questions so just you can go and uh, download from this uh, uh, link so i will provide the link in the video description if you required so uh, let's start with this uh, today a uh, topic that is the what is the major difference between the store procedure and the user defined function so uh, the first point you need to be tell Uh, that uh, store procedure are pre compiled object okay what is the meaning of the pre compiled so the compile it once and uh, whenever the execute they not compile again okay so this this will help to uh, increase the performance of the code uh, since the store procedure is uh, basically they uh, create the execution plan so whenever the store procedure created and uh, when when the first time when you execute the store procedure they created the execution plan and uh, later they will u- reuse the execution plan so if you execute more than 10 times also uh, other than one time they reuse the execute ex- existing execution plan that is the reason store procedure is much faster than any of the object but uh, other, on the other hand the function is compiled and execute every time whenever it call so whenever we call the function each and every time the uh, function ex- executed a function is compiled and executed okay so now the second difference between the user defined function and uh, uh, store procedure is the function must return is a, a, a value but the store procedure uh, is return is optional okay let's see, let's see through this some example here okay so like for example i have this user defined function that is the update email address so you can see always in the uh, function uh, we have the return value but uh, in the uh, 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 any of the store procedure uh, this is the optional My, like if you selecting the value or not it's not required this is not the mandatory this is up to the developer only so that is the reason uh, the user defined function is must have the return value but uh, uh, store procedure is it is an optional the second param- the second uh, difference is the function can have only input parameter where procedure can have input and output parameter so whenever if you remember whenever we create the store procedure uh, like input and output parameter so this store procedure have the input parameter and this is the output parameter so in the procedure we have both the input parameter and the output parameter but in the user defined function only have the input parameter okay so the next difference is the function can be called from the procedure where procedure cannot be called from the function okay so uh, last video number 63 i discuss about within the store procedure Uh, we we can call the f- function so you can see this is the store procedure we can call the function but within the function you cannot call the store procedure okay 
now the next difference is the uh, the next difference is the uh, from a function we can call another procedure or a function where a from a function we can call another function but not procedure like uh, for example if if this uh, i discuss in uh, uh, video number 63 that uh, you can see this store procedure we can call the uh, function uh, and uh, we also discuss within the store procedure we can call the multiple uh, store procedure but in the user defined function you can call only the function you cannot call the uh, uh, store procedure you cannot call the procedure now the next advanced difference is the basically uh, the store procedure allows select as a dml okay like, like uh, you can uh, in the procedure you can use the dml operation insert update delete and select but uh, the function allow only the select statement within the function you cannot uh, uh, create the table you cannot insert the data you cannot delete the data procedure cannot be utilized in select statement where the function can be embedded in the select statement so basically whenever uh, we required uh, the, we can call in the select statement as a function but the procedure is always we need to be execute the third advanced difference is the store procedure cannot be used in the SQL statement where anywhere in the where clause. So within the where clause, you cannot use the store procedure, but uh, you can use the in the function. You cannot. We can use the where clause uh, user defined function. Uh, next difference is the function that return the table can be treated as the row set. This can be used in join with the another table. So with the function you can use to join it with the under table to just uh, filtering the data and also within the function you cannot use the try catch block uh, but in the procedure you can use the try catch block same the transaction management also you cannot use into the function but transaction management you can use into the store procedure and also uh, the function is uh, uh, calling by using the execute statement but the uh, function is calling by using the select statement. So uh, this is all the major difference between the user defined function and user defined function and the store procedure. In the store procedure, we have lots of flexibility, but in the user defined function, we have uh, lots of restriction is there. So that is the reason uh, uh, store procedure is more useful in, as compared to the user defined function. Uh, but if a small small requirement you can go with the user defined function so uh, i hope you understand the basic difference between the this uh, user defined function and the uh, store procedure if you have any question if you have any doubt you can put the question on the comment box so definitely i will reply it so uh, thank you so much for the watching complete this video i will meet again in next video thank you